This week's question comes from Tabitha from Athens, Georgia. Roger, I used to watch your videos with my daddy when I was a little girl. I know you've been all over the place hunting. What was your toughest hunt? All right, thank you for that question, Tabitha. <laughs> I hope you're not 40 years old. I hope you're just still pretty young when you were a little girl, but uh, I have been around a long time. Uh, I'm gonna answer, that's a great question. I'm gonna split it into two divisions of my answer. Uh, before I was 40 and after I was 40. Uh, before I was 40, there is no question, the toughest hunt was my coos deer hunt with Dwayne Adams down in Southern Arizona. Uh, in fact, the first year we did video, I was about 30, what, 33 years old, and I was young and full of vigor and in shape. And I remember we left Dwayne's house at two in the morning in Tucson, drove two hours south. I got out at four, walked two hours in the dark so we could be at the highest point available, top of the mountain, to glass an 80 to 100 pound deer at 1,000 yards, right? And if you couldn't see one, which I couldn't, uh, could, couldn't find ones back down the valley up to the next mountaintop and do it all over again. Woo, let me tell you, by 10 o'clock in the morning, that had been a long day already. And I am still to this day thankful that I shot my coos deer the very first day. <laughs> he's not a monster, but he's a pretty good buck, all right? Uh, now, after I was 40, there's no question he was in New Zealand, all right, which was just a couple of years ago. You know, what, you know, what took us two or three days just to get there. And then the helicopter flies us up to the top of the mountain, again, six, 7,000 feet. Didn't even land, just kind of kicked us out and said, see you next week. Well, let me tell you, it didn't take a week to me, for me to have all the fun I could stand. All right, I'm sleeping on the ground, that little old tent, and up and down, straight up and down. Once again, trying to shoot a little old bitty 80, 100 pound animal. Yeah. Man alive, I did get my chamois, all right? But by the time the chopper come back to get us, they just took me right off the mountain, right straight to the emergency room in the hospital. <laughs> it's not like I've spent a lot of time in the hospital, you know. But uh, uh, yeah, both those were great experiences, and I wouldn't take the world for them. But I've uh, been there, done that, and I ain't going to do them again.